I'm showing you I get Fulbright Minecraft Java Edition, so the pack I recommend is Fulbright UB, this is going to be linked down in the description below. To get this, you can simply head over to the Files tab and then download it for the game version that you want it for. As you can see, the latest game version is 1.21.5, the latest one here is 1.21.3, but you don't need to worry about that, this is going to work for 1.21.5 either way. So I recommend Fulbright UB because of its compatibility. As you can see, it works together with a lot of things, including vanilla. However, if you're already using something like Optifine, I do recommend this other pack just called Fulbright by Beyonderboy. Uh, this is one that does require Optifine, but I would recommend above the other one if you're already using it. Do keep in mind here that with Fulbright UB, there are two versions, one for sodium with polytone and one for vanilla Minecraft. Anyways, uh, here I've got Minecraft 1.21.5 and the Fulbright UB texture pack in my downloads. So we can just head over to resource packs over here and I will drag this in like so. There we are. As you can see, it does say incompatible made for an older version of Minecraft. That's fine, you don't need to worry about that. In this case, because it's the full right texture pack, that doesn't matter at all. Um, so then, once we've done that, we can click on done. And here, basically, this is what it does. So if I dig into the ground over here, and I block myself off, usually, actually, I can show you guys what it would look like. As you can see, it's going to be completely dark now, obviously, right? Because there's no torches or whatever. And what the full bright texture pack does is make it so that I can see. Uh, yeah, so here's a bit of a better example, I guess. Here I am inside of a completely blocked off cave that has no openings to the outside world, except it looks perfectly bright. And so, yeah, it really is as simple as that. Anyways, finally, talking about outdated texture packs, I actually have my own texture pack version converter, where you can convert your Java Edition pe texture packs from any version to any version you want. And as a bonus, you can also convert Bedrock Edition texture packs to any Java version and Java texture packs from any version to Bedrock, which in my opinion is pretty cool. So I'll link this down in the description below. Anyways, right now, thank you ever so much for watching. And I do, of course, hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.